This was the scene Wednesday night in Borough Park when a group of men in the so-called red zone of coronavirus restrictions beat up a journalist covering their protest against closures ordered by Governor Andrew Cuomo. Today, the governor, in a teleconference, made this claim that the Trump campaign is the source of the violence. Specifically, the governor said this robocall was made to residents in the community before people took to the streets. And we just hung up the phone with a group of us going in and are in touch with the Trump campaign. Come to 13th Avenue and hold big signs, Como killed thousands, as many as possible, as big as possible. The Trump campaign is urging us to hold as many and as big signs as possible. Please send this message around, make it go viral. The most prominent journalist attacked, Jacob Kornblue, has spoken with PIX11 News. Over 100 people were like trying to gang on me, uh, kicking me, uh, pinching me, uh, um, uh, some threw objects on the back of my head, uh, trying to assault me. He specifically said that radio host and city council candidate Heshi Tischler led the attack against him. And this afternoon, Tischler made this statement. The DA is going to be arresting me on Monday morning to the 6 6 precinct. I will be turning myself in. I'm not sure yet. I'm thinking maybe let them come get me. He did not say whether or not President Trump's campaign was behind the confrontation, even though the crowd was flying Trump campaign flags. Leaders of a group of more than 400 rabbis said in a Zoom news conference that they're taking the violence seriously. A Jew attacking a Jew is not okay. It is not okay. And everything must be treated uh, as an act of violence. And if anybody has been encouraging that violence, they too are violating basic Jewish law. And I'm not an American lawyer, so I can't speak to American law, but they are responsible as well. The governor's comments echoed that. All good, decent New Yorkers should be outraged. President Trump was asked about it on the Rush Limbaugh radio show today. His answer? I had to beat off the phony Mueller report. I had to beat off all this stuff. I had to beat off impeachment. I had to beat off Congress, everything else. They then send it to New York, which is all political. They send it into New York, the same stuff into New York. You have to beat that off. And the ultra-Orthodox Jewish organization that filed a lawsuit against the governor's order uh, that uh, group is called Agudath Israel. They said they're going to try to appeal the judge's decision and try to make it possible for houses of worship to have more than 10 people in them while this order is in place. Meanwhile, though, the order stands for the better part of the next two weeks. Right now, reporting live from Borough Park, Brooklyn, I'm James Ford, PIX11 News.